everyone read it, including myself, and went, there's nothing here. You have one, two, three, four, five, six paragraphs of nothing. But there was one part in there that pissed off Mark Rubin, and that opened up the floodgates, and then he started responding to everyone about everything, except for a release date. This is X Defiant. The I one thing that was said that really fucking got to him was there was people at uh, there was people that was saying uh, this game is being delayed because they're trying to copy shit like from Modern no Warfare 3, Black Ops, Cold War, and all that type of shit. Yeah, and he lost. He got. He got. He took that fucking personally. He he, he yeah. outright responded to people saying if there's anything we're copying. It's older cod, and he responded to Faze Jeff and said, "Did you ever play Medal of Honor?" And it was kind of like a "Shut the fuck up! You don't know. None of you know what you're talking about." Type of thing. Mark Rubin is pissed. So Mark Rubin went on this full fucking rampage of just going off at everybody. Yeah, he went skits. You want to break this and shit we, down for us, Moz? We said he fucking would. We said not to mess with Mark. We said he. You know this motherfucker used to be part of Modern Warfare 2. He's the cunt. In the fucking cover, he's mm. used to motherfuckers going at him. He's ready. He's been waiting to, at the top of the mountain for a motherfucker to challenge him, and he went in on people. It was crazy. There was people asking him about stuff, and then he was just roast him, man. It was actually, it's actually funny because there is a lot of dumb cunts who are just like cod chills who are roasting it right, and he will just wreck them. It, it is good to see that. But at the same time, I think he's roasting some actual X Defiant fans, right? It's well, he's like, on a rampage. It's everyone. Everyone. Yeah, I think he um, made trouble for some of these responses. I think, oh, yeah. Um, I can, higher up said Ubisoft. He might have gotten, he um, gotten the fucking phone call the next morning being like, what have you done? Keep scrolling down. There'll be one where he replies to someone. And it, it, the, the last bit is just, was that easy enough to respond? Like, was that easy enough to understand or something like that? It was... It was so fucking funny, man. Did you ever play Medal of Honor? The game seemed like it was trying to be a direct competitor of COD. So he's, he's yeah. even fucking going off at phase Jev. Yeah. Fuck, um, man. He, man, he, so, there was a, so he tweeted so, so much, much, man. Fuck. And this is all one night, bro. By the way, he was silent it. for months. He was quiet for ages. Did you look at this one. FYI, I have nothing against what you posted, right or wrong. I think it's great that people are excited for leaks of any kind. And my eye roll, my sorry, my eye roll wasn't to you, but to people who said that our delays were trying to be more like COD. Yeah. Uh, here we go. And we've said in the past that we're aiming at a different time in the FPS history, i.e., older CODs. So are we chasing older CODs to some degree? But we don't want to be like the newer CODs are. <laughs> Man. Man, let him cook. Let him See, as cook. long as as long as other people in Ubisoft who are higher up have the same aspiration that's why i still have some hope for this game but the problem is ubisoft has shown me time in time out how much of a shit company they are and how much yeah. they just like to make money try exactly he's promoting he starts promoting hell divers here as well <laughs> wait so it's taken six months to fix net code and a friends list i respect you and all but there's got to be something else holding he says you're kidding right that's probably the fastest anyone's built a new netcode system and social system. I'm not kidding at all. It may sound simple to say to build a new netcode and social system, but it's no joke, a lot of work. Hats off to devs on the team doing this work. So it's better to say, fuck you. Oh. Mm. Oh, Mark long. Rubin needs to start a fucking YouTube channel where he just reads people's uh, tweets. I gotta be he honest. Wants them to go fuck themselves. <laughs> it, it's actually kind of refreshing. To see it's a higher up defenders team, and like Ubisoft would just say, "Oh yeah, I've got shit workers." Whereas Mark's like, "Fuck no, we just built the best fucking and fastest fucking netcode." Fuck y'all. Look at I this man. I kind of like that. I, I wouldn't mess with him. I got his eyes. Honest, it's like I still have Xbox 360 messages of people threatening to fucking kill me. You fucking Ubisoft cucks me nothing. Yeah, like this man. Ubi is cucks. Born. I gotta be honest, I he's the type of motherfucker you accidentally look out while passing in the street and he'll fucking you know what I mean he'll make your job. He's gonna fucking swig at you. Yeah, um, just you'll be walking by and he just goes. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's right, that bitch. Type of motherfucker. It looks like he needs to go to bed. Yeah, he it's does. Hard to but anyway, with this whole fucking game, 
I kind of lean on cream side of this one. I think what's going to happen is assuming the launch is decent. If it's a bad launch, it's dead. It's fucking dead. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But if the launch is decent, I think it will keep a player base. Yep. But it's never going to explode. <laughs>